The next part of implementation for FHIR is FHIR implementation guides. The implementation guide is actually a FHIR resource and is created for a particular implementation use case. It includes all of the necessary FHIR profiles for that use case, the value sets, and the extensions that are part of the use case, and it includes human readable examples of how that FHIR implementation guide might be used. The fact that the implementation guide is published as a machine readable package also means that any use of that implementation guide in a specific application can be validated against this machine readable content. So to summarize, FHIR implementation guides support specific use cases. FHIR implementation guides can both restrict and extend the use of APIs and resources and value sets. In the U.S., the FHIR implementation guides are the output of the FHIR accelerators, which have been established over the last few years for use cases such as the Da Vinci accelerator for payers, the gravity accelerator around social determinants of health, and the Vulcan Accelerator for Clinical Research. FHIR implementation guides are listed in the official registry of implementation guides at the FHIR.org, and there are over 160 such implementation guides currently. There's also a larger registry of implementation guides at simplifier.net. And as an example of the use of implementation guides to support government regulations requirements. The U.S. Core Implementation Guide is an implementation guide for some 29 different FHIR profiles that comply with U.S. regulations. So once again, the registries of those implementation guides can be found at the URLs on this slide at FHIR.org and at Simplifier.net. I will conclude by uh, pointing out that uh, FHIR is freely available, downloadable as machine-readable content. There is no membership or license fee required to make use of FHIR. FHIR can be redistributed and can be used to create derivative specifications or implementation guides. So with that, I will conclude this final element of the overview of the FHIR specification.